We are rolling. Q92, I'm Nicolina, your midday diva. It is on, it is here. Gaga for Gaga, and I have three grown men in the studio with me right now, dressed as Gaga. I'm giving away my final pair of tickets, the biggest show coming to Cleveland, Lady Gaga, July 14th at the Q. And as you can see, I've got my blonde weave on, and I made some uh, cigarette glasses, you know, in her latest video. So uh, they're not lit, they're not smoking, but I don't want to blow up tonight, and I don't want to lose my hair. So. I've got my fabulous contestants in here. I'm going to introduce you all to Gaga number one. And remember, it is up to you, the Q92 listeners, to vote on your favorite Gaga. And you will have all weekend to do this, all the way up until Monday at noon. I'm going to tally the votes. And the Gaga with the most votes, I will call you Monday, and you've got two tickets to the hottest show this summer. All right? So let's start things off. Let's introduce Gaga number one. His real name is Corey, but he is going by Flame. Gaga. Welcome, Corey. Hello. Corey, why don't you tell everyone, uh, you were actually, you skipped school to make it today, and I think you've been put together your outfit and try and win, right? Yeah, I skipped a few days. And uh, I don't condone skipping school, but when it comes to Lady Gaga, I guess it's okay, right? Oh, yeah. Now, you are all decked out. The reason we're calling you Flaming Gaga, you have, I'm going to uh, explain to the listening audience, you have a leotard on that is bedazzled, and what's going on down there? Because it, 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 is that tucked? I am tucked in places I never thought it'd be tucked before. Now, Flaming Gaga, have you ever dressed in drag before? No. This is your first time? Yes. You've got the bedazzled sunglasses, you've got the blonde hair, you've got the bow, you have the boots, and I mean, you even have the boobs. Mm -hmm. And speaking of the boobs, you are actually the Gaga that performed at the award show where her tatas actually became sparkling uh, fireworks. Yep. And you actually have sparklers sticking out of your tatas right now. Yep. <laughs> Do they, uh, is that because we're going to light them up? Oh, yeah. Really? Yep. Okay, light them up. He's got an assistant here. This is Flaming Gaga lighting up the tatas right now and is going to be sparkling just whoa. Watch out other Gagas. Look at that. I gotta give him a round of applause. That is looking good. Um, wow. Flaming Gaga number one. Amazing. So how long did it take to put together this look? Um, about a day. And you know, this isn't a cheap to look like Gaga. How much did it cost you in your outfit today? About 120. $120. Yep. All right. Gaga number one, Flaming Gaga, Corey. I got to say, you look great. You've got some competition. All right. Thank you, Gaga number one. Thank you all. All right. Somebody blow his tatas <laughs> out. <laughs> all right. Let's meet Gaga number two. Gaga number two, your real name is Billy, but today you are crime scene Gaga. Yes. Wow, Billy. Um, I, I got to let everyone know, in the new video for Telephone, Lady Gaga is wearing nothing but caution, crime scene, yellow tape, and that's all you're wearing. No underwear. No. Nothing down there. No. Who helped you get... My, my wife. Wrapped in? <laughs> wow. Okay, so you're doing this for your wife. Yes. Okay, now you even have lipstick, makeup, and the wig on. He's yes. got it all. And you are... Turn, turn around. <laughs> okay, that's a lot. I, I see a lot. Okay, so uh, we are calling Gaga number two, crime scene Gaga. He's wearing nothing but caution crime scene tape. And have you ever done this before? No. Do you feel like less of a man? A little bit. A little bit, yeah. <laughs> wow. Uh, props to you. Thank you so much. Big round of applause for Gaga number two. We see a lot of him right now. He's very exposed. All right, now let's meet Gaga number three. His real name is Jeff, and we are calling Jeff Vintage Gaga today, and Jeff has an interesting story. My original number three Gaga backed out today because of a family emergency. So, Vintage Gaga, Gaga number three, Jeff, only had less than, what was it, two hours to prepare this look? Just under two hours with driving time. With driving time. Okay, put that mic up to you here. So we can hear you. Step up to the mic. There you go. Don't be shy. All right, so let's explain the look to everybody here. You're kind of wearing a chiffon black shirt. Kind of, um, yeah. You do have tattoos, though. I have lots, yes. Okay, have you ever done this before, dressed in drag? 
Honestly, yeah, once, but not to this extreme. Okay. No. You also have a hair. Uh, is that your real hair? Yes. Real, real hair. hair. A flower in his hair. He's got some sunglasses on, a little scarf, some necklaces, bracelets, and very tight pants with heels. So this is vintage Gaga, a more subdued Gaga, if you will, um, not so outspoken. So maybe Gaga on a Sunday. Is that fair to say? Yeah, on a Sunday afternoon, a little stroll through the park. Okay. And who helped you put this look together? Uh, I have to give all the credit to my little sister. Aww. Her clothes, her makeup, her everything. See, so. now that's what, when brothers and sisters can share the same clothes, yes. it's amazing. Yeah, scary, but... All right, let's give Gaga number three, Vintage Gaga, a round of applause. Very shortly, the pictures will be up, and you will, and you will be able to vote. Again, you'll go to Q92Radio.com. You'll be able to vote on your favorite Gaga, whether it's Gaga 1, Corey, Flaming Gaga, Gaga 2, Crime Scene Gaga, Billy, and Gaga 3, Vintage Gaga, who goes by the name of Jeff. And actually, when I return, uh, maybe we'll take some comments here from some of the office workers and see what they think, put in uh, who they think should win, and I think I'll even chat about who my favorite is too so thank you gagas and we'll be right back drag for gaga we're going gaga for gaga on q92